Huso and his partner moved into their new house just outside of Washington, D.C., they had no idea what kind of hellish nightmare they had entered. Their neighbors seemed to begin an odd campaign of spying on them. So this is such a good, like, community gang-stalking example. That's why I'm putting it on video. I wonder what they're looking at in there. I have no idea what they're even looking at there. And not just Dominic's neighbors on one side, but the neighbors on the other side seem equally bizarre. Look at them even taking pictures of and their house. And his partner were intentionally harassed as both neighbors put up screeching yard alarms that blared all day. complaints to the police, the alarms were finally removed. But that didn't stop the aggressive behavior as the neighbors seemed to actually try to back over Dominic and his partner in the streets. neighbors were confronted, well, things really took a turn toward the insane. <laughs> oh my god, he's a dirty bastard. But this story has a happy ending says that he and his partner have now moved to a new home in a new town and are much happier. Oh, so they were stalked because they were gay. Looks like they were like a male couple. That's interesting. <laughs> 